We're back at Levi's Lounge. It's been a while. It has been too long, Murph. If you're asking me, it's too long. There were a couple of hiccups, but we're back <laughs> just yeah. in time to tap dance on the Giants' grave. I'm kidding. Come on, I'm man. I'm yeah. kidding. But listen, Saturday night, that was special. The Santiago Casilla loss after they had gone all that way. Yeah. And you can use, I don't know if you want to call it scapegoat, but let's start with Casilla because, listen, the sweep in San Diego was team-wide, <laughs> all right? The <laughs> plenty of blame to go around. But that's Casilla's fifth blown save, second most in the big leagues. Yeah. So what do you do if you're the Giants? Do you continue to run the veteran out there, the guy who's been with you through three parades but whose stuff is getting wobbly? Or do you make a change within the team, bring in Sergio Romo to do it? Can his elbow do it day after day? Or, of course, Bobby Evans and his cell phone. Yeah, if Bobby Evans wants to get on the on the, on the horn and make a few calls, Bobby, you go ahead and do that because I'd like to see what's out there. Then you start parting with your beloved prospects. You know these well, kids. You, you fall in love with these kids just by name only. Yeah. Christian Arroyo, <laughs> Phil Bickford, yeah. Chris Shaw, Adalberto Mejia. These are all the names. You know. So uh, here we go. I mean, I'd love that. I, I had a feeling coming into the season that Casilla was going to be. It was going to be turbulent. Yeah. I'm of the belief that maybe Sergio Romo is the guy. Okay. Um, I think he's highly motivated. I think there's only 70 games to go. His arm is fresh. He's got the experience, yeah. too. And he hasn't been taxed coming into this. You know, he's basically set out the first 90 games, essentially. Yeah. Uh, so you're talking about a fresh arm going in. Now, you know, I mean, the elbow has been tender and it has barked, so it's not a no-brainer. I expect they're going to make a trade of some sort. Okay. Is it going to be Araldus Chapman where you trade the farm system? I don't know if I'm willing to go that far. Hmm. They're smart about finding the guy that you and I aren't thinking of, right. who comes in and is effective. I'm really kind of throwing the ball into Bobby Evans' yeah. score and saying, yeah. dazzle me, Bobby. Find me an arm or two, like you did in 2010 with Javier Lopez and Ramiro. I'll just close Ramon with Ramirez. this, Murph. I know Bobby Evans, he's pulling all the right levers with his Little League team, and I trust <laughs> he'll do the same with the Giants. Yeah, they scored 22 runs on Sunday. I'm telling you, they mean so business. I'm not going to freak out about the sweep. I'm going to go Marty Lurie and say, 162. <laughs> okay. 162. I'm in, but man. I'll go to Boston and see what happens. I love it. And New York. In the meantime, Bobby, what do you got? See you guys next time.